exported fruit is now required to undergo a mandatory 25-day cold process treatment before being exported. The new regulations were published and implemented while large consignments of fruit were already enrouted to the EU under the old rules. The citrus industry sees the new regulation as politically motivated with no science to back the decision. So this is just a, uh, a really a poor judgmental administrative rule to try and protect it against the Spanish interest, which I still fail to understand because we count the season. We are the best news they have. We're out of season. We keep consumers eating oranges and, and mandarins and lemons, which outside of the, of the Spanish season. So we are keeping people loyal to the product. So we are really their best news. So this political motivation because of le elections later in the year is just diabolical and done for the intent to harm South African citrus. It's not warranted and supported by any data or science. The new regulations were published on the 21st of June and executed three days later. The South African government says this is unfair treatment of a trading partner, as the rules stipulate a six-month notice period for regulation changes. There hasn't been enough consultation with uh, South Africa, which is one of the trading partners with the European Union. Secondly, the time frame at which they are asking our farmers to consult is actually unreasonable because firstly it came already in the harvesting season you know that the citrus season in south africa starts from april when it's your uh, lemons in particular and then may june july the citrus uh, oranges and uh, nitis will come on stream so you can change rules in the middle of uh, a season the citrus industry has already lost 200 million rand due to the new regulations. Nkabisi Ngana, SABC News in the Eastern Cape.